Hi, I'm Steph from Renovation Baby and today I'm going to show you how we upholstered um, an IKEA Jules desk chair for my daughter for her little bedroom. Um, it was quite tricky, <laughs> let's put it that way. I was sent some fabric um, from Yorkshire Fabric Shop and it's a beautiful um, velvety, uh, very very light cream white fabric with deers on. So I wanted to use this for, the, for this and another project. So I wanted to use things that we had already in the house rather than spending out an extra. So we had a cushion that was a, that had been used for a dining room chair and we had some old, um, some brand new carpet underlay that we haven't used. So we popped the staples in the back here and we made sure that the cushion folded all the way around and stapled underneath. We also placed the um, carpet underlay up and over the back of this so that it kept it um, tight and secure. Make sure you keep the screws in now and keep them there, don't let them come back through. Um, think about your corners and your edges um, to try and make them as neat as possible. Um, a nice little fold like that would do nicely on this edge and the fabric will just roll over it. Make sure you cut your fabric and give yourself plenty of overhang um, and just basically do your best. We found it pretty tricky. Um, we wanted to keep the shape, we wanted to pull the fabric nice and tight, as tight as possible, um, but we also felt uh, on the on the back here, we couldn't pull it because the back is moulded and we couldn't get the, the, the pull tight nicely, but we did our best. And we folded it up and over all the way across from the top to the back, and as you can see on the top right hand side where my husband's hand was, you can see we stapled it in there and it made a nice neat edge. We used an electric staple gun and you really do need to put some effort in because it's um, straight into wood and then through all the prep fabric and everything and just basically mould it to what you like. So this was our final um, final piece, final creation. This is how it looked in her room. I think I might spray the actual legs a colour at some point but it ties in with her bedroom and it looks really nice and it's really comfy. So I also did a little headboard here with the same fabric, so I thought I'd give you a quick look. I've done a video for that too. And yeah, so I hope you like our little idea. It makes it much comfier than it was beforehand and it ties in with the room. So thank you very much.